to start out uh, this lesson, of course, deals with the labels. Yeah. And in this lesson, we know that there was uh, a dispute concerning, I won't say a dispute, but there was some concerns about one working a few hours versus yeah. one working long hours. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I have just one more thing that I want to do. Uh, ask for the watch if there's any newcomers. This is my parable. I'm trying to make this live. Now, so y'all yeah. go with me. I know about the denarius, right? Penny. Yeah. Who in here has been a member of the church over 50 years? Raise your hand. 55 years. 60 years. 65 years. Somebody will keep their hands up. Okay, 65 years. Now, that's the denarius. Anybody less than two years? Three years. Two years, here we go. Now y'all remember this now. <laughs> Object lecture. Yeah. Remember this. Those two coins. Yeah. I gave one to Sister Boyce. Yeah, huh? Man. I also gave one to Brother Wing. Yeah. Okay, so y'all y'all remember that. Now <clears throat> Matthew 20, verses 1 through 16 is a parable of the laborers. Uh -huh. Jesus tells a parable of the laborers in the vineyard in response to Peter's question in Matthew 19, verse 27. All right. Now, before we dive into that, we got to understand that Peter was asking a question uh -huh. based on Jesus' encounter with the rich young ruler in Matthew chapter 19. Right. So in Matthew 19, verse 23, then Jesus said unto his disciples, Verily I say unto you, that a rich man yeah. shall hardly enter into the kingdom of heaven. And again, I say unto you, it is easier yes. for a camel yes. to go through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to enter into the kingdom of God. All right. When his disciples heard this, they were exceedingly amazed, uh -huh. saying, well, who then be can be saved? Come on, God. But Jesus beheld them and said unto them, with men, this is impossible. Yeah. But with God, yes, all things are possible. Amen. Yes, sir. Yeah. Then answered Peter, and said unto them, Behold, we have forsaken all, what we gonna and followed thee. <laughs> and what shall we have therefore? All right. Because Peter realized that this rich man had great Possessions. Uh huh. But he will with sorrow. Yeah. So Peter said, Well, you know, we don't have great possessions, but we've given away the whole lot of things to follow you. That's right. And Jesus said unto them, Verily I say unto you, uh huh, that ye which have followed me in the regeneration, when the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, uh huh, ye also shall sit upon twelve thrones, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. Uh -huh. Verse 29. And everyone that hath forsaken houses, yeah. or brother, yeah. or sisters, or father, or mother, or wife, or children, yeah. or lands for my name's sake, shall receive a hundredfold, and shall inherit, inherit everlasting life. Uh -huh. For many that are first, will be what? Shall be last. Okay. Those that are last shall be first. He'll reverse the order. Y'all see the corner? Yes. Sister Borders been a member of the church for over 60 years. Uh huh. Brother Wingham been a member of the church for less than a year. Yeah. Uh huh. That coin that 
she has has the same amount of weight as the corn that Brother Whitney has. Yeah. Yeah. They both can take their corns to the store and purchase the same amount. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. But when we look at the labor, come on, preacher. 60 years versus six months. Come on, yeah. preacher.
which he had a thought before a thought prepared unto glory. Uh -huh. Even us, yeah. even us whom he hath called, not of the Jews only, yeah. 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 but also to the Gentiles. Y'all in chapter 10 or chapter 1? Acts chapter 10. Yeah, come on, word. Verse 44 and 45. Acts 10. Verse 44. Key, and 45. Y'all make it hard on me. Y'all ain't saying much. They chose me hard on me now. Y'all listen. Acts 10, 44 and 45. The Bible says, While Peter yet spake these words, the Holy Ghost fell on all of them which heard the word. That's right. And they of the circumcision which believed were astonished. Uh -huh. As many as came with Peter, because that on the Gentiles yes. also was poured out the yes. gift of the Holy Ghost. Yes, sir. Yes. Do y'all know who y'all are? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Come yes. on, help me preach, brother. <laughs> we are the Gentiles. That's right. Yes. Ephesians chapter 2, Word verse 13 through 19. And I'm almost through. You got 20 I still got a little bit more to go. Yes, sir. Great. Ephesians 2, verses 13 through 19. Yes, sir. Watch this, y'all. <laughs> Let's get verse 11. Now, Paul says, wherever, well, forever remember. Now, we're talking about this Jew and Gentile relationship. Yeah. We're talking about being first and last. Yeah. We're talking about equality in the kingdom of God. That's right. Wherefore well, remember that ye being in time past Gentiles yeah. in the flesh, yeah. who are called uncircumcision by that which is called the circumcision in the flesh made by hands. That's right. Yeah. That at that time ye were without Christ. That's heavy, God. Being aliens from and, and strangers from the covenants of promise, having no hope. That's sad, y'all. Having no hope. Come on. And without God in the world. That's right. But now. But, but now. now. Yes. In Christ Jesus. Y'all ought to be shouting. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But now. Yeah. In Christ Jesus. Yes. No. Ye who sometimes were afar off, what happened, but are made yeah. now by the blood of Christ. Yeah. God. For he is our peace, yeah. Yeah. who hath made both one. Yeah. Jew and Gentile. Go on, work, God. Equal. Remember I told y'all to underline equal? Yeah, yeah. If you want more to words in your Bible, underline it. Don't be scared right here. Yeah. Made us equal. Made us one. That's yes. right. Yes. Y'all still don't know what chapter. <laughs> and have broken down the middle wall of partition That's between right. us, having abolished in his flesh the enmity, even the law of commandments, containing in orders for to make in himself of two one new man. Equality, God. Equality. And that he might reconcile. Jew and Gentile. Unto God. In one, 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 one body. One body. Amen. Would you the church? Good teaching. By the cross, have explained the enmity thereby. Yeah. And that he might, and he came and preached peace. peace unto you which were afar off. Gentile. And to them that were not Jews. For through him, yes, sir. we both have a, a cross by one spirit unto the Father. Now therefore you are no more strangers for us, but fellow citizens with the saints and of the household of God. And are built upon the foundation of the apostles. Jesus Christ. Yes, sir. Cone of the soul. Yes, sir. Two plain. And the message in verse 16. Uh huh. The last will be first. Yes. And the first, first. last. Is that no matter how long or 
how hard a believer works during his lifetime. Yeah. If you're faithful right. to the end, mm -hmm. that's right. Whether you've been a Christian 50 years or 50 days, the reward of eternal life right. will be the same. Yes, sir. Jesus said in Matthew 25, 21, well done, well done, that good and faithful servant. Thou hast been faithful over a few things. I will make you ruler over many things. Enter in into the joy of thy Lord. The thief on the cross of Luke 23, 43. Jesus said, today thou will be with me in paradise. Yeah. Equality in the kingdom. Uh -huh. If you're here tonight, oh, you got 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> the invitation will be five more. If you're here tonight, and I know I've said enough for you to get the picture. Man, yes, yeah, sir. Hearing, Romans 10 17. So then faith comes by hearing, and hearing by the, the word, word of God. God. You come believing. Mark 16 and 16. Uh -huh. He that believeth and is baptized Shame. shall be saved. But he that believeth not <laughs> shall be damned. Yeah. You come repenting of your sins. Luke 13, 3 and 5. Yeah. Yeah. For I tell you, Nate, that except you repent, you shall all likewise perish. That's right. And you come confessing with your mouth. Romans 10, 9 and 10. Yeah. If thou confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus and shall believe in that heart that God has raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. Yeah, yeah. This is the gospel according to 1 Corinthians chapter 15, That's verses right. 1 through 4. And complete your obedience in war. That's Acts right. 22, 16. That's right. And now why tarries thou? All right. Arise and be baptized. Wash away thy sins, Indeed. call it on the name of the Lord. Amen. Equality in the kingdom. Yes, sir. This parable, Jesus explains by way of this parable to Peter uh -huh. that the last will be first and the first, and the first will be last. Mm -hmm. It's not about what you have ascertained. That's right. The Jews, and we see this parable as the, the kingdom of God, the vineyard is the kingdom of God, and yeah. the, the landowner is God himself. That's right. The steward being Jesus who's handing out the papers. Yes, sir. I like that. I like that for you. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. So tonight, if you are subject to the Lord's invitation, why not come? As we together stand and sing the song, Pass 